Hey Google, what time it is? It's 12.47 a.m. What's going on guys? Uh, today I'm going to show you how to install uh, Google Assistant in your PC or whatever it is you're using. So without further ado guys, let's get started. So the first thing you're going to go to this website. Uh, all link will be in the description and uh, you go to uh, cancel the action dot google dot com you click here create new project and you can name this project you can any name you can say g uh, system you can name it whatever name you want name it so i'm just gonna name it g assistance okay so once you're in you're gonna want to click here here to registration you click okay so if nothing shows up if you have any added blocker make sure you disable and refresh okay once you disable click here to register model any name also uh, you can call this because I'm using a uh, Dell I call this Dell that's the product of my PC Dell and uh, the name of manufacturer you can name your name or whatever name okay type of device so you're gonna I'm here and you can say speaker it's fine okay so after that you click here create you register I mean so this is your auth uh, code you're gonna want to download this and once it's downloaded you're going to download it so this you download you're gonna have to uh, uh, put it in local C create a new folder I can name this assistance assistant and you paste there your project okay make sure it's in C okay so after that you go to this website which they um link is gonna be in the description if it doesn't see your project uh, once you click here you click here on a select project and you're gonna see your uh, your G assistance that we create earlier you're gonna select your project okay so once you select your project now you're gonna click here and click here to uh, API and services click there so once you in API and services you're gonna search for you click here and you search for Google assistance okay so you're gonna click here to where it says uh, Google assistance API and make sure you click here on enable so once you click on enable you click here on credential Okay, so this is your uh, your email that you, we're gonna use uh, just in about a second. I'll show you. So click here on 
auth credential once you click here you're gonna want to click here on edit app okay so this is your email okay once you're here you scroll down where it says developer you're gonna put your email the same email that is on okay so once you're there you're gonna click save and continue uh, save and continue okay so once you're here you're gonna click you're gonna add also your uh, email again Save and continue. Boom. This part is over, and now you're gonna go to this website. Uh, as well, link will be in the description, and make sure you click on Windows EXE and uh, they follow the name EXE Windows Assistance. the download is finished this your google assistance you're gonna double click run agree you can click for all user continue Okay, so finish and run Google Assistance. Alright, alright, alright. So you're gonna click on Get Started. Uh, proceed. As you can see here uh, there's a file we're gonna need you're gonna click here um, this key file here you're gonna click on a browser and go to C where you save the assistance folder click and click on open save uh, click here on automatically set path relaunch okay it says failure you you go back to here to google cloud once you're here you're gonna download this g assistance uh, download this one So once it's complete, you're gonna take this, you're gonna cut it, cut it, and go here to assistance, and you're gonna delete this, and you're gonna paste the new code, close here, okay, so you're gonna go to browser, Make sure you go the same way again as you see assistance. Got this one open. Uh, you click and it's gonna take you directly to Google and make sure you click in with the email that you sign in with. This one. And click here and continue. Okay. 
as you can see if nothing seems to be working since it, it seems nothing to be working make sure to copy this code as you can see here it's that here code up to here up up to end and cop code echo make sure to copy only this code so copy um come here paste it control v and click on submit all right so relaunch and there you go there you have it so you can change uh, settings like hey Google uh, you can enable uh, X -Mam always on top display blah 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 dark mode anything after finish saving after setting once you finish just click uh, save so you can ask it now stuff uh, hey google what time it is it's 12 47 a.m oh since i have two google in installed in the house so he, i think you can hear another one uh, you can say things like show me direction to Pizza. To choose, you can say things like the second one. So, which do you want? The second one. The best way to get to Domino's Pizza by car is via Imperial Avenue and will take about four minutes in light traffic. You see? So, there you have it, guys. The best way to get to Domino's Pizza by car is via Imperial Avenue and will take about four minutes in light traffic. Flip a coin. Tell me a joke. Here's a joke for Valentine's Day. How did the fire fall in love? It found its perfect match. can also type so many things many things many things you can do many things so there you have it guys subscribe to the channel and I'll catch you in another one guys Peace.